Let's look at this graph. This graph is, just think about it, what is this graph depicting? It is depicting a function fx equals to 1 by x. Okay. Now, this function f is a function that goes from r minus 0 to r minus 0 okay because you will never have a 0 in the range and you will never uh, you can't take 0 in the domain right because it will be undefined then now is this function bounded or unbounded that's the question the question is bounded or unbounded now here if you see whatever value of x you put the value of the value of fx would be 1 by that 1 over that okay so if you have 1 it will be 1 if you have 2 it will be half and so on and so forth it will keep on moving it will keep on moving Let's say here the highest point is 1 and so on and so forth there is no end to the value it will never come out to be zero it will never be zero it will keep on moving asymptotically it will keep on moving asymptotically so that means the set of images is not bounded so 1 by x is not bounded and hence the function 1 by x is unbounded it is neither neither bounded below nor bounded above it's neither bounded below nor bounded above so it is an unbounded function okay now similarly similarly we can also take an example of say okay let's take an example of another famous very famous uh, another very famous actually famous function which is the function what is it looking like a bit like e x right so exponential function e x this is the function of e x f x equals to e x the graph goes some somewhere like this right so there you have a 1 out here at 0 e to the power 0 will be 1 and thing to the power 0 will be 1 and so on and so forth now this function again what is happening here you keep on putting values of you know e to the power 1 e to the power 2 and so on and so forth this function is from r to r plus it is a function from r to r plus because you only get exponential values are positive all the values that you will get will be positive and that's why i have not made specifically drawn the y axis the negative y axis now this is again an unbounded function why because it's image set of its image what is the set of its image it's zero to infinity it's zero to infinity it is bounded below by zero it is bounded below by zero but not bounded above at all so th that is why this set will be unbounded because the range is 0 to range is all positive all positive 0 to infinity so it is bounded below but not bounded above so therefore unbounded okay this function is unbounded because it is bounded below by 0 but not bounded above